My name is Anna Smist. I'm a member of the Sac and Fox Nation of Oklahoma, and I'm Deer Clan. I am also a junior at Yale College and one of the tour guides for the Yale University Art Gallery's special exhibition, Place Nations, Generations, Beings, 200 Years of North American Indigenous Art. The biggest display case in Place Nations, Generations, Beings is devoted entirely to art intended for the tourist market. The case includes my favorite object in the exhibit, a pair of beaded moccasins that say Alaska on them. Some viewers may have an impulse to relegate this and other tourist objects as Indian kitsch, meaning that they appeal to an Indian aesthetic, whatever that means, and are therefore in poor taste, but I love them. Indigenous art serves as a means for indigenous artists to pass down cultural knowledge in and around their tribal communities. The Clinket artist who made the Alaska moccasins employs spot stitch beadwork and material resembling moose hide to potentially inform buyers of the links between the state of Alaska and indigeneity. Alaska is derived from the Anunga word alakshuk, meaning where the waves break their back. So the artist could be activating buyers' imaginations of Alaska within its history with indigenous peoples. The Alaska moccasins have educational value for tourists who may not have considered indigenous culture or ways of knowing upon their travels, and may not be aware of where the name Alaska came from in the first place. Regardless, they provide an opportunity for a dialogue across cultures. The beaded letters that make up Alaska on the moccasins stand out on a bright red background and rest above a flower that kind of reminds me of a sunset almost, or maybe the sun peeking out of a cloud. Either way, with the fur lining on the interior of the moccasin, you can just tell how cozy and warm these would be on your feet. This pair of moccasins, albeit made for the tourist market, still serves as a representation of diligent beadwork and sewing where every stitch counts. The Alaska moccasins prove indigenous artists know how to make a comfortable pair of moccasins into a work of art.